Hey guys, what's good? How you doing? I hope you are doing well. Welcome to Vinyl TV. If you are new to this channel and if you are, please consider subscribing and we appreciate it. Thank you very much indeed for stopping by. Thank you very much indeed for clicking. This is HP Desjet 2, excuse me, 3720. This printer is multifunctional printer. It's multi-tax, triple in one if you like. In the sense you can copy, scan, print from this gear. I'm going to give you an overview of this printer. Then for us to connect this printer to Wi-Fi network. This printer is dual band. You can connect it via Wi-Fi network and USB cable connection. From the back here, we have the power cable. Three pin power cable is included in the packaging. This is the USB cable, what it looks like. The good job is USB cable is included with the packaging. From the back here, this is the rear paper tray. You can load various sizes of paper, A4 paper, 4x6, 5x7, 13 by 18 centimeter and 10 by 15. So you can load various size of paper and just need to adjust it, okay, with the holder. Now, going to turn this printer around. This printer is using N cartridges, 304, triple color and black. 304 is what it's using. You can also use 304 extra large. Check my video how we install the ink, okay? And also with this printer, you got three months ink free. And this printer, you can go from your phone and print easily. It's one of the smallest printer out there. I'm going to bring the camera to show you some of the features where to switch this printer on. This is the on and off button. And you can see the LCD screen. Inside this LCD screen, you can see amber light and also a blue light here flashing for the Wi-Fi. It signifies that it's not yet connected, but once it's connected, it will be a steady blue light here. Okay, this is for you to copy color. This button here is for you to copy black. And this is for you to information button. It will ask you to press this information button to identify your proximity. And this is button here is for you to resume. This button here is cancel. This is the Wi-Fi button. And this is when you connect this with your mobile device, it will highlight, okay, or Wi-Fi direct. Now, what we need to do is also to show you step by step how to connect this printer to Wi-Fi network is what we are going to do. So what we need to do right now is you can connect this printer using the app or stick this CD-ROM and download the software to your PC and connect this printer. What we need to do right now is to show you the process we need to go through, okay, to connect this printer to Wi-Fi network. We need to get our mobile device. And once you get your mobile device, I need you to go to your Play Store. Okay, this is the Play Store. Now type HP Smart App. Type HP Smart App. Okay, here is HP Smart App. Install it on your mobile device. Right now is installing on my phone. So once you download the software, we need to look for this printer. So right now is installing HP Smart App. Okay, now is install. Click it open. And once it's open, now what we need to do is we need to agree to to terms and condition and once you agree to terms and condition it will start to connect to HP service getting the necessary information ready now 
from here you can you see we need to set up a new printer or sign in or skip so what we want to do is set up a new printer now it's asking us how do you want to set up how do you want to connect this printer via wi-fi network airtime uh, cable select wi-fi network click continue now it's asking us get your get printer ready to connect to wi-fi place the printer on a flat surface then plug it on and power on connect your mobile device to wi-fi network turn on nearby device permission location precise location and bluetooth on your mobile device allow access when prompted hp smart require this information to find and set up your printer your location is not being sent to hp so this is just to reassure you that this things you need to do so what we need to do right now is to click continue now allow hp to find and connect click allow okay click okay while using this app allow hp to assess device location while using or you can select allow one time or while using this app okay so right now it's searching for printer is what it's doing now it's telling us my printer is not listed what we need to do is make sure we go back click continue again my printer is not listed then if you click my printer is not listed then if you search for printer again now printer not listed tap to find printer alternative okay find printer alternative Wi-Fi, we use temporary Wi-Fi. You see HP setup, click series. So right now I can see it's connected. Okay. And let's set this printer. Click continue. Select your wireless network. Okay. Select the wireless network. What we need to do right now, I need to put the information. Okay. And at the moment, you can see I want to show you. So if you can't find it, because this printer is web. So if you can't find it, you select printer is not found and follow the instruction. Right now, I want to show you. You can see the light here is still flashing. Once it's connected, it will be a steady light. Okay, it will still be a steady blue light. And what I need to do right now is to put get the information for for the what for the wife for the Wi-Fi network. So I have the information right here. So what I'm going to do right now is to put the details for the wi-fi network and once i put it on then i will come back to you okay and also make sure you press the i sign to check if the information you put is correct okay and i'm happy with it once you don't click once you don't the next thing you need to do is click done okay click continue and it's telling us right now printer found okay i can see printer is found printer prepared what is doing right now is obtaining ip address ip address obtained is finishing connection so right now this here we go printer connected to wi-fi network okay and i'm going to bring the camera for you to see if you look at here right now you can see inside the printer you can see we have right now a steady blue light for wi-fi it's no longer flashing and inside this printer you can see you can also see the light here for to show you that it's, it's wi-fi direct is connected okay so right now this is how to install the ink and this light here 
is for the paper is not yet loaded once you loaded the paper this light will go off and so this light right now is just for the paper and this printer is right now connected to wi-fi network i'm also going to show you for you to see just for you to know that then the next you need to do is click continue right now it's connecting to the hp service so sometimes people will say i can't find the printer but there's alternative what you need to do just need to follow the instruction so right now it's checking the printer status okay click accept this is for you to uh, connect to printer service right now it's asking us create an hp account or sign in to register your printer okay because this is tutorial i'm going to skip account activation but i will encourage you to do this if it's your own printer so i'm going to skip account activation now it's telling us don't miss out on automatic printer and warranty registration skip it here we go it's telling us right now redeem three months printing with hp instant ink like i mentioned earlier this printer you have option to redeem three months you, you, you got three months ink redeem this offer within seven days enroll instant ink now but i like to use pay as you go the essence of it is you receive original hp ink in few days get hassle free delivery and recycle never run out of ink and save up to 70 percent after the trial if it's something that if it's your own printer you decide if it's something that you like to do but my own like i mentioned earlier i like to use pay as you go so i'm going to skip the benefit are you sure i want to skip the benefit yes skip the offer now printer out update automatic update okay click apply here we go set up complete let's print so right now if you want, can, can see this jet 3700 series all in one printer okay so if you want to print document right now just need to load the paper tray and print it out this is how to connect this printer to wi-fi network if you're happy with this tutorial please do consider to subscribe it helps the channel thank you very much and stay blessed. Thank you.